it's the natural thing for original people to represent the truth of God. Mm. Even when the truth of God may be ugly because the world make the evil look pretty. Mm. The evil is always going to be dressed up to look pretty. That's the history of evil period. It's always made to look better and sometimes even feel better. How can you discern the difference? There you go. And that is a journey. That is what it is. That's what living is about. So when people are looking for the meaning of life, it's really mo about that and the thing that challenges them the most. And that's why it's not a game you quit. It's a game you keep playing to the end. Right. It is about self-discovery from the beginning to the end. And yeah, discernment. Discernment is wisdom, you know? And wisdom is experience. And experience only happens when you do. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if you sit on your information and then you're paralyzed by the information, you, you, you won't make it very far in the journey mm -hmm. because you got to do something with everything you come to know. So you got to be reasonable and and that's where like mathematics comes in because like we're not weighing one number in the journey from one to nine as being more important than the other mm. you know what i mean like they they have their roles and they have their purposes but they're all supreme mathematics mm. so the way in which um a person experience knowledge is only meaningful in the context of how they experience wisdom next because mm. otherwise it didn't make a change and in mm. science Information alone is not significant if it doesn't result in a change. Mm -hmm. Even the measurement of work scientifically is force times distance measured. There's got to be movement. It's not just about putting in effort. So a lot of times we're stressing and yet we're not going nowhere. That's wasted energy. Mm -hmm. And we've been trained to do that because we've been trained to be ineffective. But our stress is supposed to be converted into passion. Mm -hmm. That's what we've always done. And when your stress is converted into passion, you become productive in, in amazing ways. And that's where abundance comes from. Mm. Because it's those pressure points that allow us to produce portals. Because the pain, the pain is a, is, a very, is a very deep thing. Pain is our teacher on this planet because out beyond this physical experience of having a dense body, there's no real pain. There's loss, there's separation. There, yeah, there's even misunderstanding and blindness of all sorts yeah but there's not the pain that you need to know it's wrong so that's where the discernment comes in we're blessed to be in a world of pain because at least here we can discern what we don't want more of that's so real. because in a gaseous or energetic state that comes before the physical being let's say we grow distant from our love mm. Let's say we grow distance from each other in some way mm. that we in this body probably don't understand fully but how would we feel the pain of that mm. to become distant from that which once was close to you? Mm. How, what if there was separation? What if you go from being one to being split into two? Like, how would that be a thing that you really know the importance of going back to one unless it kind of hurt to become split? Unless splits kind of hurt, that's the only way you know coming together feel better. That's the right way back. The right way and, and that's the weird thing because you could always take temporary pleasure that don't last and come with pain on the back end mm -hmm. if you're mm -hmm. not timeless in your thinking mm -hmm. if you only think in like a very like that's the fate of this world too because you can get so caught into the physical immediate reality mm -hmm. that you think that's reality mm -hmm. that is not the supreme reality mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but the pain is there to remind you and to send you in a direction where you don't escape into a short-term pleasure that come with more pain because you're clearly learning you're clearly aware and you want to reduce pain that's the nature of every human mm -hmm. no matter what you're some people are born into chronic pain they got conditions that you can't even imagine how do you live like that for them they're that some of those pains are normalized they've gotten used to that but the pain of somebody not treating them well that's you know what i mean right or the pain of something else you know what i mean it's so everybody got their pain and the pain is like, how can I change? So imagine if I'm born with no arms and, and this caused me great difficulty. Mm -hmm. But what really pains me is that people treat me different. Mm. They treat me like I'm not even a fucking human. I don't like that. And that's my pain point. Mm -hmm. I could get by making these stubs work, mm -hmm. but not the way you make me feel like I'm a fucking animal or a mm -hmm. thing, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And that's for anybody's anything. It could be vitiligo, it could be whatever, right? It could be eczema, ashiness. Why, why you, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You think this is the problem, this is really this. And so whatever is the really this, that's the thing you're transforming. So person with no arms is like, wow, you would think they're not gonna grow arms. That's not their journey. They, if, if the thing that bothers them most is the fact that 
their parents treat them like an invalid, mm. it's like they got to master that. Mm. And the parents is part of the mission. It's this weird ass video game of sorts where it's like, yo, your parents is part of the mission. You got to do something with these. Uh, clearly, because that's where the pain is coming from. Mm -hmm. The pain is your teacher. We hardly see it that way. We've been trained not to because guess what? In this world, the devil sell you medication for pain. Yeah, temporary relief. That's the nature of what the devil going to offer you. So as long as there's those that can make money, including the devil minions, who they just see easy way to make money is pain relief. Instant gratification. Let me make you feel better short term. I don't care how you do long term. That's not my business. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that's the shit. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's how they do. Mm -hmm. And those that choose to go to that, they're going to go to that until they're tired of it. Mm -hmm. Some of them may be their whole life before they realize it's been the wrong way to invest. Yep. Yep. It's, it's, the, it's the beauty of the choices that this world offers us. Yeah.